I, I feel as though, I don't know if there's a secret formula. Um, I think it's just staying true to, you know, what makes you happy and what you'd like to do. So if, if volunteering makes you happy, yes, go and do it. Because then I find that uh, particularly through the application to the University of Sydney and the interview process, they asked a lot of kind of personal questions and I get the feeling, and again, I would love to hear both of your thoughts as well, but um, at the time when I was going through, I felt as though I wasn't just a number and they were trying to really figure out who would be the best fit for their program and for their patients in the future. And so because of being, I guess, authentic to myself and the extracurriculars the things that I involved myself with um, while I was studying, I felt I could speak a little bit more to it without sounding robotic, if that makes any sense. Um, and I feel as though that may have given me a little bit of an edge. Um, I remember being asked some very personal questions about growth. So things that have, I guess, allowed you to grow and led you to this moment that you're here today. And this might sound a little silly, but speaking about it and having a bit of, I don't know, whatever we had gone through um, to get to that stage. I cried during that one question of the interview and the interviewer cried with me. Um, and I later got to know that interviewer as one of our professors and he remembered that moment. And so I just feel like, again, I don't know if there's a secret formula with numbers and CV and GPA and everything that we're always working towards. I feel like if you have that and you're at the stage that you are applying to medicine and dentistry, you're probably competitive. You're probably, you know, already you have that. So just working on yourself to be, I guess, a more well-rounded applicant in person, because at the end of the day, you're going to be their health professional. So, um, do the best for yourself to do the best by them. But 